on going down this dig deep road. Next on the Snap Judgment stage, I am so excited. First time ever on the Snap stage, but he is only 15 years old. You might think that doesn't qualify him to tell a story here today, but just you wait. Please put your hands together for Mr. Noah When my mamas fight, they go on long car rides, come back, and I hear our car stay still. They come in, and Robin goes directly to the bedroom angry. Maria will sometimes make toast, pour water. I sit in my room quiet, listening like a radio antenna. My mamas drive a CRV. They bought it brand new. The car is big boned practical. It is our car. I have been one with this CRV for so long now. We used to drive for miles out on the highway until I fell asleep. It has taken me to martial arts practice and school plays. This is the car that drove me to the gay pride parade where I skipped through the crowd throwing mini Oreos. This is the car I'll learn to drive in, the car I'll remember. Last Tuesday night, my mother Maria comes into the house with a weathered smile. My other mother, Robin, and I are sitting in the room. Maria asks us if we'll take a drive with her. So we all get in the car, our hearts thudding in offbeat unison. And as we drive, silence settles in. And I wonder, and then I know, this is it. And I didn't imagine it would end like this. I didn't imagine an ending at all, but if they were going to tell me about the divorce, what a way to do it. I sit in the back seat. I wonder when they'll say it, how they'll say it. I think about how my time will be split between them. I wonder what'll happen when they see each other afterwards. Will it feel like collisions? I don't want to meet a new girlfriend. I can't imagine anything but this. Its ending is unthinkable. My heart hurts at the thought of our last miles, these miles. Who will take the CRV? In the back seat, I think about how lucky we were to have had this family. Their 20 years of marriage, my 15 with them. I remember when Maria drove away one night without saying where, when Robin packed up her things one day and Maria ran outside to stop her from leaving. I remember when I came to them crying at the idea of separation. I remember when Robin came out sobbing. I remember when Maria whispers at Robin to be quiet and Robin yells louder. I feel these walls crumbling. I don't want this life to end. Maria starts to talk. I pinch my leg and look out the window. She tells me that our car, our CRV, is just 13 miles away from reaching 100,000 miles now. <laughs> I wonder if this is part of the divorce speech or just a distraction. <laughs> I feel angry, they should just say it. She tells me the reason we took this ride is so that we could all be there to reach 100,000 miles together. <laughs> as the people who matter in her life. Slowly, I come to the realization that this isn't a breakup ride. This is a stay together ride. We're in the car and we're driving on a Tuesday night and we're 99,987 miles in. We stop for onion rings and Sundays. Keep driving, 99,993 miles. Stevie Nicks, 99,996 miles, Elton John. When we get to 99,999 miles, we hold hands, clasp Melissa Etheridge, and sing Lucky at the top of our lungs. There are two main reasons that my mama found love in each other's presence. There are too many moments when we are unbreakable, and in 
moment we are one family, constructing road as we go, burning bridges behind us, adding mileage like graceful aging, driving in our CRV towards moonlight.